One, two, and three. Hello everyone, welcome to Tigers. Look what I've got to show you here today. Rich and Royal Mini Swing Machine. This I got it from one of the e-commerce sites and it costed me about 1100 rupees. Yeah. So this is the swing machine. Let me keep this aside for a moment and then show you what are the other accessories that you get. Uh, you get a foot pedal along with the machine. Yeah, this is the foot pedal. Quite decent in terms of the quality. Uh, you get an adapter. Yeah. And along with that, you also get other accessories like extra needle. You get an extra needle. You get extra four bobbins along with the ones which are already fixed in the machine, which I'll show you later. Along with that, you also have a needle treader. Okay. All right. So these are the accessories that you get along with the uh, machine. Now, let me also show you uh, the manual. You get a manual with the uh, machine. I would advise you to go through it before you even uh, start using the machine. All right. So let me show you around and tell you what all functionalities it has now you get a switch button here which is uh, low and high uh, speed control that you have on and off button instead of using the pedal you can just switch on the machine and it will start stretching by on its own and this is the lamp light on and off so you get a lamp here while stitching during the night time or doing the low lights probably this is the light that you can switch on I'll show you later and along with it you have a bobbin holder here this is the tension screw wherein you can adjust your stitch accordingly yeah so this is how it is and also you can use this machine uh, without the electricity using your uh, AA batteries. You would need four AA batteries to run this machine. Yeah. Okay. And this is the. And this is the thread spindle. Okay. You can probably use this while getting your thread into the bobbins. Yeah. Remember to rotate this hand wheel only towards yourself when you're using the machine. All right. So let me also show you in terms of where you can put in your foot pedal. This is the pedal plate socket where you can put in the foot pedal. And this is your power supply socket where you can probably plug in your adapter. All right. Also at the bottom, you can see that there's a bobbin, which uh, you will need to insert it before you stitch it. So how do you thread it? I will show you a little later. Okay. And ensure that the take up lever is up when you're not stitching anything or you want to, you're done stitching and you're taking out the clothes from the machine. So that's about the machine. Okay, let me show you how to thread this machine now. Okay, you pull the thread out from the bobbins. There are places, there are places where you need to put this thread through. Okay, here, okay, it goes in here. All right, then you have a tension uh, screw here where you need to insert the uh, thread then okay all right you're almost done so you have another one here you can see it okay 
it will take you a little bit of time while doing this activity but however after this things are gonna be easy for you so one more here okay let me put it down okay so now this is how you treat now the last and the most important thing how to thread through the needle okay so you can make use of this threader insert it into the hole of the needle and just put this inside the threader okay you're done pull it out so can you see that it's so easy to thread this with a thread up okay now when you're putting the bobbin below the here below here ensure that it is rotating clockwise take out the there's a place here where you can take out the thread okay so get it out this way and uh, your bobbin is rotating clockwise ensure to close the bobbin compartment okay all right so all you need to do is now uh, get this down and and you need to get this thread out of a hole which is there below this needle okay so you'll have to do that as well so how do we do it take down the take up lever and then rotate this hand wheel towards your hand wheel towards yourself okay rotate it fully okay all right now pull up the take up lever now you can see that there's a thread which has gone down and it has pulled up the thread from the below okay all right so here you go you have the thread from the down and from the up get the thing get the thread below the threader and let's see uh, if uh, this really works I'm going to take a piece of cloth and then try stitching this okay and I'll just show you so you'll have to place the cloth below underneath the take up lever and then pull down the take up lever okay here we have placed the cloth now now let's connect the foot pedal I'm gonna connect this in the place where yeah it's given okay here this is the foot pedal please okay connect it I'm gonna put this down uh, I'm gonna put put this foot pedal down so that I can use my foot to run this machine also your adapter okay this is the power supply socket where you can connect the adapter okay we are done we are connected now okay let me put this into the socket okay it's done all right so let's put this machine into test and then see if it really works and i'm going to test this into this cotton cloth which i have uh, earlier i told you that there's a power lamp here which you can switch on while uh, you know stitching uh, you could do that while using your mas machine uh, using the foot pedal I'm gonna stitch this and then show you if this really works yeah so let's begin one two and three it's working guys you can see it you can also increase the speed of this uh, machine by pressing this button here this is low and this is high yeah so you can see that
All right. So that's about it. Uh, let's pull this off and then see how did the stitch go. Okay. So let me pull this down. Yeah. Okay. Pull this towards the left so that we can get some tread off the machine. And then at the side, there's a cutter here. Instead of using your scissors, you can just cut, cut it off here. Okay. All right. Let me switch on the. Okay. Let the lamp be there. So let me show you the stitch how it really. Yeah. So this is the stitch how it was done. Okay. And also let me show you the middle side. So it's quite strong, guys. Uh, I'm impressed with the kind of you know stitch that it has done. Uh, all right. I also missed mentioning one thing. Uh, you can trade your bobbins here, and uh, this is the place where you probably pull up and put your thread here, and then you can probably thread your bobbins here. Yeah. So this is how it goes. All right. So let me pull off this. So hope uh, you have liked the video. In case if you have liked the video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more such videos. Uh, I would likely put a, another video, uh, the second part of it, on how to stitch through this particular machine. Alright, so stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.